and thank you for coming to this video for January 20th, Trashy Town. So we are going to make a, um, a garbage truck. So first what you need is a long piece of paper or a big piece of paper. This is actually cardstock. It can be any color. It can be a big piece of construction paper. It's entirely up to you. You need some colored construction paper or paper. Um, some black, or if you don't have color, you can always just get white paper and get some crayons and markers to color them in. You'll need some regular school glue and then some stick glue. And then a pair of scissors, of course, and some extra leftover tissue paper, any color. So first what we wanna do is let's practice writing our names on the bottom of our paper. If you have a really little one and they want to write big, that's okay. We'll write it on the back and then we can always flip it over. So we just want to start by writing our name down here at the bottom. There we go. All right, so now I'm going to make my trash truck. So I'm going to take this piece of paper, a construction paper that I've already pre-cut into this rectangle shape here. And I'm gonna take my Elmer's stick glue. The stick glue is probably the easiest when you're trying to glue paper to paper. So I'm gonna put this all over the back side here. All right, and I'm gonna stick it right about here. This is going to be the dump, the part of our, our, our trailer, our um, garbage truck that has the trash in it. That's kind of the back part of it. And then you want to take another piece of paper, um, same color, different color, um, totally up to you. And you want to cut it smaller. This is going to be the cab, the front of the truck. It can be another little rectangle, it can be square. However, whatever you think looks good. I'm going to put it this way so that my truck is has a really big uh, trash part and then a little tiny little cab here. See? I'm gonna turn it upside down so you can see it here. So there's my trash part. Here's the cab of my truck. And now we're gonna need some wheels. So I just took out some black pieces of paper, construction paper, and I just cut circles. Your circles don't have to be perfect. Um, how I get semi-perfect circles are I use um, one of these hole punches. These are actually coming really handy when you wanna get perfect circles every time. You don't have to have something like that. You can always just cut them out. See, I got a little, little issue right there, but that's okay. We can cover that up. Or we can just leave it. That works too. So go ahead and get some glue on the backs of your wheels. And then we're just going to stick our wheels. You can stick it right there. And we're going to put two more here. I'm going to get our wheels nice and glued. And they can be bigger. They can be smaller. We're just trying to get our glue all over our wheels here. There we go. It's starting to look more like a trash truck, huh? Okay. Then we can put our stick glue away. So now we can put our trash in there. So that's where our tissue paper comes into play. So you want to cut these into kind of little squares. It doesn't have to be exact, just little squares or rectangles, kind of like that. Okay, and then what we're going to do is take our, our tissue paper and we're going to crumple it into a little ball, kind of like that. It doesn't have to be super tight, and we don't want it to be too tight. And then what we do is we're going to glue it to the top here with our, with the Elmer's school glue. This has, this will help so it sticks on there a little bit better than the stick glue. You just want to give yourself a little glob here. And go ahead and stick some there. And repeat it with another color. If you don't have any colors and you just want to use white, if that's what you have on hand, that's okay too. I'm going to put a little bit there. I've got another color. I'm gonna put it here. And remember your glue, you can put a little bit kind of ahead of time if you want, if your glue's coming out good. And just have 
just have your little one stick it on there any combination of colors if you don't have any any colors you can just use white or you can even use tissue like Kleenexes if you don't have colored tissue paper you can just use some Kleenexes or even paper towels or bath tissue anything that they can kind of crumple up a little bit and then just glue in little globs on to the back of your truck here pretty much anything that can kind of pretend like it's you know trash let's go a little bit more glue here on the back And I'm going to finish up the crumple. We're just going to crumple. I just want to cover cover all of our glue here. Doesn't have to be totally perfect. Just kind of want to get all that glue covered. Get a little bit more. There we go. All right. So that's it for the back of our trash part here. So the last part is now you can just, if you want to, decorate the rest of your truck. You can add trees in the background or a road or a little sun in the corner. I'm going to make a little, I'm going to turn this around so I can see it. I'm going to make a little cab area here because that's where the driver is going to be. I'm going to put him right here driving this, driving the big old truck. There he is. So you can accessorize your trash truck however you want. So that is our easy paper trash truck.